Peace, love, and light, Scorpios. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose. Scorpios, thank you for all your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. We are on the road to 10K. Thank you for your support in getting there. Personal readings are being offered at this time. All information can be found in the community tab as well as the, the description box. Let's get into your messages. Okay, so let's check to see what is in your energy. High Priestess. Mm. <clears throat> so this High Priestess is coming up with the Two of Wands. Hmm. Someone may be thinking about you. Someone may be watching, studying you. Like uh, this High Priestess uh, energy is someone... That's not you. Someone else is coming with the Five of Wands. This is someone who has their eyes on you. And I'm saying all oh, eyes. Oh my goodness. This person that's showing up here in this High Priestess energy, they've got some really like, they've got some like almost outer worldly energy or it seems like there's just another side to them that you don't see so it's possible that there's another side to this person that you don't see and there's something about this energy that's connected to the five of wands mm. There may be something connected to this energy with the five of pentacles. Hmm, five of pentacles. Interesting. It actually says eight of pentacles, but I'm reading five of pentacles. Something about... <clears throat> it's almost like giving an energy of like... Losing something like some sort of like... like a financial financial loss five of cups okay my my uh my attention is being drawn to the energy of the five of pentacles for whatever reason yet i'm seeing eight of pentacles so it's like this eight of pentacles it's either supposed to be read as the five of pentacles or there's something to this eight of pentacles that's showing up that's connected to a five of pentacles energy and i'm seeing it's possible that um this high priestess this i'm i'm thinking this is this is a cancer pisces scorpio someone who's a cancer pisces scorpio um that this may be related to now what is it about this five of pentacles that you need me to see spirit what is it mm -hmm. okay there, there's something about this there's something of about the five of pentacles that um being drawn to okay and the four of pentacles just comes out hmm my attention is being drawn to the king of wands some something about <clears throat> someone being taking the lead in something possibly queen of wands Okay, so King and Queen of Wands, there may be something about um, a relationship, a union of some sort that's connected uh, to energy, that's connected to uh, something else, something else that they want me to see. Five of Pentacles energy. Let's see, they want. Uh hmm. 
Okay, so there's something connected to this high priestess having to do with a home. Keys to a home. Something about this hot high priestess regarding keys, like a home energy. Oh, this this person wants to kick you out of your home. It's either they want to put you out. <coughs> okay. Hmm. This person see it's interesting and in now it just shows up something about this this could be here because this high priestess has some this see the eight of pentacles is about something you manifested something that like the eight of pentacles comes about as a result of the work that you put in the investment that you put in for some of you what you manifested is a home or a place of stability a place that you call home and this high priestess is trouble this this high priestess uh, she's this high priestess is either struggling or causing struggles in your life now again this high priestess could be a cancer pisces scorpio this is a water sign showing up showing up with the five of wands connected to like some conflict <clears throat> this person could be causing conflict between you and someone this person could just be like it's almost like this five of wands is like a warning so to speak and this person this this person that's showing up is watching very closely watch possibly watching your moves there's something connected to their energy and this five of pentacles energy it's like this five of pentacles energy was screaming to be screaming to be found goodness gracious uh someone wants to remove you from your place of security for some of you this may not be a home this may actually be just a place where you have some sort of stability security um i'm seeing a physical place like where that that this person is literally trying to like remove you from it's like this person trying to move you remove you from something that you worked hard for it could be a uh it could be a job position too for some of you take it as it resonates uh yeah investment see this is the seven of pentacles this right here the seven of pentacles comes before the eight of pentacles so usually you work on something you spend your time your energy your hard work your earnings to get to a certain goal right and then when you when you get to that goal uh, this is the this is the eight of pentacles you reaching that goal it's like you know what it took to get there you know the kind of work the perseverance the sweat <laughs> that it took to get there um Mm-hmm. Patience. The patience it took getting there. This is something that you created from from a lot of resilience, a lot of work. Uh, there's that conflict again having to do with some beginning. Some you know what? Like I, I it's like from the very beginning. Usually when I see the high priestess it's this energy of like this person uh, someone connected to like you know higher level being truth seeking uh your spirit guides this is someone that has a different side to them and it's possible that there's a different side to this person that you have not seen oh 
Look at that. You showing up again. This person could be going through some things. This person, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, could be going through some things. Uh, this is someone who's like repeating cycles over and over again. Possibly not having learned some kind of a lesson. They're about to learn a, a very major lesson. They're about to. The tower moment this person's about it and I'm mm, they're about to get a like a major disruption because this person hasn't learned their lesson for whatever reason they, they may mm, ace of swords For the most part, I'm seeing this person may not may not really have it's possible that they haven't learned because they have oh it's possible that they're repeating cycles because they haven't learned. Do you want to tell us about this energy? Ooh. This is a possible uh, water sign mother figure <laughs> that haven't learned their lesson. Uh, oh, yeah. Stuck. Stuck somewhere. Stuck in some crossroads. person's in need of guidance because they may be stuck somewhere this person can also be seen in the uh king of queen of wands energy no i said king of wands uh hmm. i'm seeing on the surface this person may even appear to be confident they they may appear to have everything on the outside that may not be the case on the inside Okay, the Hermit card showing up towards Virgo Capricorn. I'm seeing this person, it's possible that they may be, or they're about to experience like a, a very, like a rude awakening showing up as a tower moment. Eight of Pentacles. Mm. this person is very much concerned about what you have the rewards that you have the abundance that you have the prosperity everything that you're getting this person's like watching the abundance that you're walking into or that you have they're watching and also this person is calculating something see this is this page of wands is them calculating waiting to make some kind of move on your home for some of you this resonates as really weird as it sounds And it's also possible that this person wants something. Uh, seeing the Queen of Wands again. Mm. Uh, there, there, there's some aspect of the relationship with this person that's kind of showing up as a. Possibly some relationship that um, that's no longer the same. It could be you and this person's relationship may no longer be the same, or it's changed. There's some aspect. 
Mm. I'm I'm also hearing that this Queen of Wands may be significant. Hmm. Perhaps this person sees you in this energy. Someone who 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 has a home or values your home. Tell me about this five of pentacles. Ooh, connection, relationship, harmony. Huh. There's something about a connection having to do with this person. It could be a a connection that's related to you, some connection that you have. Mm. Oh, some connection that this person may possibly want ended. This person is really trying to cause some like havoc here. It almost feels like this person, hmm, someone who doesn't want someone to progress. They don't want you to be, it's like you're this light, you're being recognized. Um, and it it's showing up like. Like you're an energy, and this is what I'm being drawn to. Like you're this sun card, an energy of positivity, truth, light. So, there's something about your home. This, this thing um, that's showing up, this energy that's showing up about your home, it could be that this person... Uh, is trying to interfere with a connection that you have within your home. Trying to interfere with energy of light, positivity. Tell me about this Five of Pentacles. I'm here to be careful because this person can influence something having to do with your home. See that? Ten of Pentacles showing up. It's almost like this person could be sending evil eye energy or something like that. Trying to sabotage uh, your stability. Like because this Ten of Pentacles is your stability, your inheritance, your home. This person could be... They could be trying to sabotage something having to do... There's some home... I'm hearing there's some home-related matters that may need your attention. Or this person... Someone's concerned with something having to do with your home. It could be the home itself... Or it could be some some connection that's a home related matter, a family related matter that that, that someone has some kind of influence or uh, tell me about this ten of pentacles. Hmm. They're trying to restrict something having to do with your home. Either restrict you. Keep you out. Kick you out. It's an energy of like isolating you. Okay. And I'm also seeing this is why this uh, hermit card may be here. Is they're trying to isolate you from something having to do with your home. This person's deceitful. like someone's pulling some string uh, 
it could be energetically. Tell me more about this Five of Pentacles. Ooh. It's like someone sending like... Uh, it seems like a spell or they're doing spell work. To keep something from working. Something having to do with your home, your stability. Something, it could be something within your home, a relationship, uh, a partnership. Mm -hmm. Some, okay, I'm hearing, keep on guessing. Uh, and then as soon as I heard that, I saw something about a nine of cups. They could be like, for some of you, you may actually live in a home with a water sign mother figure who's actually who's at who actually may be sending like evil eye energy to block something having to do with your home your stability something about your home this could be a relationship uh possibly divide a relationship or something having to do with home um it's it's like this person the very first thing i saw in this is someone literally like putting someone out of their own home like leaving someone out keeping someone out hmm. anything else <clears throat> okay this is what they trying to do to this empress whoever this is this person sees or, or knows that you're an empress and you represent this empress this could literally be like a resentful or bitter kind of like either a karmic mother figure or um a mother figure that may not necessarily be your mother someone's mother mm. it's like this person's trying to slow the progress between you and someone that showed up right here in the two of cups and the three of cups whatever progression that you're supposed to make this person's doing something uh it's, sh it's showing up as different things evil eye energy this person could be literally bad mouthing you sending evil eye energy trying to keep uh <laughs> which which is which is a means of like literally like keeping certain things from happen like if someone speaks ill about something enough and i and i'm getting that this person may even know this like it's not by accident that this person speaks ill will this person wishes ill will towards you and this that something significant about a relationship specifically that this energy that this person speak uh speaking uh, like they're speaking is looking like an evil eye energy whatever they're saying whatever they're doing it's impacting some aspect having to do with your connection possibly uh preventing you from seeing something clearly or this person see there's there's matters of the home and I keep hearing there's matters related relating to your home that you need to uh, pay attention to. Anything else? There's that conflict again. Mm, investment. There it is. See, now it's the Eight of Pentacles. Something you've committed yourself to, you built. Uh, 
this is there's an energy of truth this may be an energy of truth or this may be a king of swords involved in this particular scenario mm. okay let's see Two five oh five seven five. Okay, messages. Tell me what else do you need us to know about this reading? Okay, this is Lolo stand in the light. Oh, look at that. As soon as that came out, the Empress card also comes out so there's something that the divine is saying to this empress or you're going to be in the light you're going to be shining in the light let's see Listen to what this says. You are unique. You are divine and being and beautiful being. You stand apart from the crowd. Sometimes this evokes jealousy or desire in others who want to possess your light, beauty, and beauty as their own. You need never fear another or believe that they can harm you. Allow yourself to be true to who you are. Do not try to hide your inner light and beauty. You are meant to be seen. Your soul is natural. Oh, it, your soul is nurtured and natural and protected by your love for the divine. Mm. Okay, now, uh, it's like you're about to be shining in a major way. Someone sees this. This high priestess showing up in is some kind of reverse like this is not like a this is not like an upstanding being this is you know they're showing up as a high priestess possibly because they have like they're able to see things and also possibly because this is a water sign cancer pisces scorpio who sees you standing in this light this is this empress energy that you're in like you're literally in your most magnificent state and this person is like they trying to kick you out of your own party. Yeah, that's why that's why that's why this three of um three of cups showed up. It's your time. And this person's trying to kick you out of your own party because it's like this person has like it's a jealous person who just can't stand to see you shine. But you shine in any way. So forget those haters. That's the message. If this message resonates. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time, love, peace, and divine light.